am feminist enough to paint my nails before I go on a camping trip. I'm feminist enough to cut my hair, shave my head bald, wear locks, wear a big nappy kinky fro, and not allow the length of my hair to define my beauty. I'm feminist enough to let a man be a man sometimes. I'm feminist enough to call him out unapologetically. I am feminist enough to pay my own bills, but I have no problem saying thank you if somebody else does. I'm feminist enough to be able to be a freelancer in New York City and hustle my way through everything, but also realize that when it's time to go home to take care of your family, it's time to go home. I'm feminist enough to love passionately and fight ferociously. I'm feminist enough to be conscious about my sexual partners and who I allow myself to be intimate with. I am feminist enough to love myself. I am feminist enough to not judge another woman. I'm feminist enough to congratulate my friends when they accomplish great things because when they succeed, I succeed. And I love seeing my friends do well in life. I'm feminist enough to be the chef in my relationship. And it's mostly because I was poor and realized that I need to Google the ingredients in my apartment and make something to eat because I couldn't afford to go outside. But that actually ballooned into, I'm a good cook. And it also made me realize that my fiance sucks at that. So, yes, we're falling into tr traditional roles, but I'm not gonna fight it, just to prove a point, so that this man can cook me some nasty food that I'm trying to eat to be feminist. Fuck that. I am feminist enough to truly understand what my mom went through. I'm feminist enough to shave, because that's serious. Shaving is serious, and it's, it's power. I'm feminist enough to achieve kindness and peace and harmony.